Okay, so we're going to look at the turtle here, starting from the top. They don't have teeth, but they call this the dentary, okay? So the, the mouth region, they just call it the dentary. All right, moving down, we're going to look at the hands first. Hands you just generally refer to as manis or monis. We're going to look at the digits. This is going to be digit 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5. These will be the metacarpals here, these little bones here in the middle. Moving up, just like we've seen in other things. Closest to digit one is going to be the radius, and the more uh, the more lateral is going to be the ulna. These two are going to articulate with the humerus. Now the humerus is going to articulate here with the scapula, chromium, precoracoid. It's kind of confusing here. What's going deep into the shell is going to be the scapula. Scapula. At the top, kind of forming this A is going to be the acromion. So that's going to be helpful to remember that A acromion. This bottom one is going to be the precoracoid then. So again, deep into the shell, scapula, coming up, acromion, going down, precoracoid. Okay. Moving down, we're going to look at the pelvic girdle. We have the pubis at the top, ischium on the back. Now going deep into the shell is going to be the ilium, going deep into the shell. Okay. So deep there into the shell, that is the ilium. All right, looking here, we're going to have the femur is going to articulate with this more thicker one. It's going to be the tibia. Going behind it is going to be the fibula. These can be tricky, so you got to make sure you keep them, keep them straight. So the tibia, fibula, looking here again, digit one, two, three, four, and five. Last thing we need to know with the turtle are the different parts of the shell. The big back part is going to be called the carapace. Okay, and this is going to stand true for all sorts of uh, shelled creatures. The back is going to be the carapace, and this bottom half is the plastron. Carapace, plastron.